Hey, this is Deja Payne reporting for the Charlotte Basketball Network. I'm here at Carmel Christian with Justin Taylor. Justin, you have been playing very well this year so far. Literally last week you had an explosive game, 20 points, 10 assists against Victory Christian. What do you think has been key for you at this point? Um, I think it's just focusing on my coach, focusing on the concepts of the team, you know, focusing on winning instead of playing for myself and focusing on playing for my teammates, and that's really helped me. Of course, keeping it team-centered is like a big factor. They could definitely help with that. Now, in the offseason, what skills were you working on the most? Uh, I was really focused on getting stronger. Uh, it wasn't a lot about like skill stuff. It was more like getting my body right and prepared to um, take the contact and being a point guard. Okay. So how much have you seen as far as difference in your body last year versus this season? Uh, it's a big difference. Uh, getting in the weight room a lot, especially with our assistant coach, uh, it's really been a big difference for me uh, scoring-wise too. Nice. Okay, cool. Well, you guys are off to a hot start. You guys are missing one right now. Literally one loss. There's not a lot of teams that can pay that. So what do you feel like has been so good for you guys at this point? Um, I think it's just the concept of defense. The coach really focuses on defense. and. Uh, us. Every day in practice we play defense, that's it, the whole practice, so we really focus on defense instead of like shooting and stuff, so it really helps us play for our teammates instead of ourselves. Well, they say defense wins ball games, so of course to focus on that is definitely a good thing. Now, I've seen a lot about who you are in the classroom. You literally are a true student athlete. You have a 4.5 GPA, which I feel like is hard enough to do alone, and then you add basketball on top of it. That's not something easy. So, I mean, what's been what's been the key to you being able to maintain both at such a high level? It's really my parents and my love for the game. Without uh, the classroom, my mom, my dad, they wouldn't let me play basketball. So, I really love playing the game. So, it really drives me to do it every day. Wow, the four point five GPA is pretty high. I mean, what's your what's your class load like? Um, I got AP classes last year. I took AP calculus as a junior. This year, I got AP stats. Um, British literature, world wow. literature, all honest wow. classes. Okay, well I took AP Calc and I took AP Stats, didn't do too well on AP Stats, so hopefully you do better than I did, it looks like you are. Um, but then I also saw you announced last year that you are going to be going to Hargrave yeah. after this season. What led you to that decision? Um, it was really the uncertainty of COVID. Um, you never really knew, we didn't know if the college teams would be playing this year or anything. Uh, senior eligibility, we didn't know if they would get another year, so just to get another gap year to really get better, get my body right, just to play in college. And to pretty much just extend your recruitment then? Yes. Okay. Well, speaking of which, I see you have offers from Elon, Mount St. Mary's, South Florida. You have quite a few schools going after you. So where are you right now in your recruiting process? Um, me and my parents really, we, we've been talking about it. We like all the schools that really have interest in me. Uh, we love them all. We keep in contact with them, but we just focus on getting better, and we'll make a decision later on down the road. Okay. Now, is there any school that's standing out above the rest to you right now? Um. Be honest. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I wouldn't say so no. at the moment. No. Okay. So they're all equal level. Yes. Ma Fair playing field. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, I really appreciate you taking time to speak with me. Of course, good luck for the rest of the season. I hope to see you guys in state. Thank this you. is Deja Payne with the Charlotte Basketball Network.